What's going on everybody, it's BC Dad for XYZ here, and welcome back everybody to The Walking Dead by Telltale. We're doing Season 2 here. We just finished Episode 1 of Season 2, and boy was that a moving episode. Let's see what horrible atrocities await us in Episode 2, shall we? <laughs> Seriously, this, this game never ceases to amaze how just how, how unbelievably violent it is and stuff like that. But um, let's go ahead and start Season 2, A House Divided. Interesting. Sounds like we're gonna have some conflicts within the household we just entered, so let's play season let's play episode two, shall we? Previously on The Walking Dead. I'm freezing. Wait till we get up to Wellington. Then talk to me about Cole. I'm gonna go look for more wood. Where's the rest of your group? I I'm by myself! Bullshit! Krista, run! I'm out. Grab her. Let's go. Would someone mind telling me what the fuck is going on here? She was bit by a dog. For all we know, she could be working with Carver. So, since you're pretty much on your own, what's your plan? I'm thinking about moving on. Well, you're welcome to stay here if you want. Jesus, Mary, and Joseph. Think about it. You're Carver, what do you do? Who's Carver? You were in the woods with Krista. Please. Ah! I'm fine. I'm fine. Just... just lost my footing. Damn it. God damn it. Come this way. Damn it, you get your asses over here, both of you. We have to go! You could have saved him! How could you just leave him? I still don't think it's right to put that on my shoulders, but that's okay. <laughs> All right. Let me guess, somehow we became trapped in there. Yes, that's true. Wonderful, wonderful. How did this happen? Off to a great start. I didn't like any of those answers or those responses. My uncle. Back at the stream. Pete got bit. What? He got bit. He wasn't going to make it. What do we do now? I don't care. If we're stuck here, we should at least look around. <coughs> Maybe we can find something to help us get out of here. Knock yourself out. So for the record, by the way, I am a little sick. I should tell you guys that. Um, I should be fine, though. I shouldn't be coughing too much. It's a still. I know what it is. The fuck you do. Okay, what then? It's for making booze. That rig ain't fit to piss in. I love how she just like he just like assumes that we don't know what the fuck we're doing. All this food is rotten. I 
said this food is rotten. He doesn't give a shit about anything right now. All right, let's try this one. What is that stuff? Let me see. Is that honey? Yeah. <sighs> Whiskey. Ah. Now what? The only good thing. <laughs> oh fuck if I know. <laughs> we wait, I guess. Well, we at least we could get her drunk and waste our troubles away. <laughs> What's your problem? I had to kill my mom. <laughs> Sounds weird when I say it out loud, huh? Luke always used to push me. I never wanted to go into business with him. Mm. I remember when he sold me on it. His big plan. Some fucking plan. Case of beer in, he just said, Nick, we're burning daylight. And that was that. Shit. After six months, we were flat broke. I didn't care. We were having fun. I wish I was like him. I wish I could just keep moving all the time. I'm just not built like that. Everyone I grew up with, it all happened to them. Now, it's gonna happen to us. Not necessarily. We're also fucked. <laughs> You're just drunk. This whole world is <laughs> fucked. You're just drunk. No shit. At least he took my advice, I mean, okay? what's the point? We'll just march to some new place and somebody else will die. It's never gonna stop. Eventually, it'll be our turn. I can't believe we've been here a day. A day. It's been a day, right? Hey, kid. I don't remember this shed being here in the last episode, though. Have a drink with me. I'm not getting drunk. I want all of my senses here. And your last. <laughs> no thanks. I was only kidding about me. He can get drunk if he wants, Listen, but I want my senses. They're not coming for us. You should go. Run for it. What are, what are you going to do? Stay here. I'm tired. Go find Luke and the rest. They'll take care of you. We can make it. We have to try. I don't have to do anything. Come with me. Are you kidding? And leave all this? You can't just sit here and die. Why not? What does it matter? You still have Luke and everyone else. They're family. Nick, I need your help. Please. You're right. And just like that, he agrees. Yeah, you're right. That's not how it works. Yeah. Now look, if we get separated, cabin's only half a mile from here. You can't miss it. You ready? Sure. <laughs> Fuck it. Oh, it's not even that light out. 
You can easily sneak around. Or not. Fuck you, motherfucker. Alright, never mind. Hey, over here! Come on, you fucks! Look at me! Get the fuck out of here! <laughs> ah, I'm gonna go. He'll be fine. He can survive. He'll be fine. He's gonna come back. <laughs> Obviously, I don't know if that's true or not, but we'll see. I'm playing through this blind. <laughs> Clementine, are you all right? Luke's not with you? Where's Alvin? What happened? It's been hours. Where are they? Pete got bit. What? What happened? Walkers. My God. Where were you? Where were you exactly? Down by the stream. We gotta go. Just hold on a minute. My husband is still out there. Get the guns. Luke and Alvin went out looking for you. I told them not to go. Damn it, Luke. Clementine, can you, can you please watch Sarah? She's upstairs. Just distract her and don't tell her anything. I'll take care of her. You can trust me. Thank you. You'll be safe inside. Just don't open the doors for anything. We'll be back soon. And thank you. I want to get on his good side. In the last episode, I kind of, like, pissed him off. I kind of want to get on his good side, though, because he, he seems to be the owner of the house. And Say cheese! Stuff like that, so. I found this under the house. There was all kinds of old stuff. It's so cool. Take one of me. Come on, take one of me. Sure. <laughs> Get me in a good pose, okay? Okay, I'm ready. She looks good. What's wrong? Um, where's my dad? Um... They're fishing! Oh, you're scaring me. They're just fishing. I know that's not true. Sorry, I, I, I just need to... What's wrong? Oof, she's been through a lot. You want to see what I found? Will you show me how to use it? I couldn't find any bullets. If something's wrong, I should know. What if I have to use one? It's too dangerous. Everything is dangerous. I need to know sometime. You should let your dad teach you. What should I shoot? Don't do that! S -s -s sorry Sorry! Maybe I could practice outside. There's that tree. Hey, Luke's back! Um, are we sure about that? Was that actually Luke or what? That doesn't look like Luke to me. This is not good. That is not Luke.
That's not Luke. Clem, I think I know him. He can't see me. You have to make him go away. Go and find somewhere to hide. Where? Whoa. Pick somewhere! Oh, I can't breathe. I can't breathe. Shh. Hello? Hello there. Get out of here, now. Is that how your dad taught you to greet a neighbor? I've got a gun. A smart girl. I would too. But I'm not a bad guy, honey. Promise you that. My family and I are set up a ways down river. I'm kind of surprised we haven't run into each other yet. What's your name? Close the door. What's your name? <laughs> My name is George, honey. Pleasure to meet you. You mind if I come in for a bit? Um, I yes, do mind. I do mind. I was told not to let anyone in the house. This, this is, is nice not place. good. Who is this guy? Is there anyone else around? You don't usually see cabins this big out here. We have a big group. Lots. Oh? How big? Dozens. They'll be back soon. And they left you here all alone. They must trust you. Well, I'll cut to the chase. I'm out looking for my people. Seven of them, to be exact. They've been gone a long while, and I'm worried they might have gotten lost. Maybe you've seen them. A couple of farm boys and an old man. Spanish guy and his daughter. Quiet girl. A bit taller than you. Big black guy. This big. And a pretty little pregnant lady. I haven't seen them. Well, that's a shame. You sure? Yes, I'm sure. sure. Who is this guy? Why is he... Ugh, Clementine, kick him out. Well, it looks like a damn tornado ran through here. Must be like close to ten people with you. More. Hmm. Just passing through or you've been here a while? Hey, listen, kid. I hope you're not one of those nuts headed up north looking for Shangri-La. Just passing through. I'm gonna see Going north. Hold up. <coughs> headed that way lately. <coughs> Sorry. Just as much nothing up there as there is down here. And I can't stand that Yankee weather. Who have you met going north? Oh, hell. A lot of folks. Anyone named Krista? No, not that I can recall. Is she a friend of yours? He's given me no reason to grab the knife yet. Oh, fuck. Where does this go? Uh, in the drawer there. Gonna say he's giving me no reason to pull the knife on him, though. Well, it's a real nice place, kind of cozy. Can he get out? Jesus Christ! I knew a guy that always wore shirts like this. Doctor. Real smug, son of a bitch. I don't care. You know, you're really not very polite for a little girl. And you're not very polite for an adult. This is my house. Fair point. Well, well. White's in trouble. Three moves away from checkmate. What was that? Why do you... Ins what are you doing? I thought you said nobody's here. Nobody is here. Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, dear. This kid. Can... 
I told you, nobody's here. Seems that way. Didn't mean to be rude. Couldn't just leave you here with a good conscience if someone was poking around, right? Sure. Who's this? My sister. She's dead. Really? Well, I'm very sorry to hear that. Thanks. You have no idea who these people are, do you? I don't know what you're talking about. Let me ask you this. When you met them, how much did they trust you? What's your point? If people don't trust you, how can you trust them? Well, I think I've troubled you long enough. I can let myself out. Good. You should have let yourself out a long time ago. W wait, who are you? You have a real good day now. I assumed he'd remember this, but seriously. <coughs> Where is he? He's gone. What if he comes back? All right, then. That was bad. We need to find the others. We can't go outside. Clementine! Sarah! You were with Nick, right? We gotta go find him. A man was here. What? What did she say? Someone came to the cabin. What? Clementine talked to him. And you just opened the door for him? Calm down, Rebecca. Calm down? I am calm. You calm down. I Whoa. didn't open the door. He just came in. She's telling the truth. Did he say his name? Did he say what his name was? No. Maybe it wasn't him. You know damn well who it was. Yeah, but I think he was lying. What? I thought he said his name was George. George? Look, Clem, just tell us what he looked like. What was he wearing? Did he sound different? He had a big brown coat. Did it have a lining? A collar? Yeah, fur. He talked about you, Dad. You're not gonna hurt anyone, are you? Of course he won't, Sarah. Uh, your dad's the nicest man I know, which is why he's not gonna do anything crazy. Or not nice. Right? You know these are bad people, sweetie. They will do or say anything to hurt us. Alright, what do you think? Did it seem like he'd be coming back? He saw a picture of me. A picture? What were you doing taking pictures? Carlos. What? You need to calm down. Alright, you're scaring your daughter. You told me to distract her. Distract? Sarah. So I'm just an idiot? I thought we were friends. He was scouting. We got lucky. He wasn't expecting to find us. Clementine must have surprised him. She hadn't been there. Yeah, really. Well, he was too smart to stick around, but he'll be back with the rest. We don't have much time. He's right. Everyone pack up. We're moving now. Alvin, wait! We have to leave now, sweetie, before he comes back with more bad guys. But it's gonna be okay. Let's just go get your things. What does he want? To bring us back. Clem, I don't know what he told you, but William Carver is a dangerous man. He's the leader of a camp not far from here, and he's very smart. We were lucky to escape. Look, I'm sorry to involve you, but now that he's seen you, you'll be safer with us. We have to leave. I'm sticking with them. Look, they seem like they Nick know what they're talking about. Here. You know where he was, right? Yeah. All right. Everybody grab your stuff. Let's hit the road. All right, cool. Well, after I get that achievement... God, there's so many achievements in this this, this series. Uh, all right, anyway, 
Well, we're right back, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you guys next time on The Walking Dead Season 2.